Human finger found in Tacoma driveway. ID'd return to owner. Wow. As far as mysteries goes, this sounds like a real nail biter. It's definitely not what you think of when you hear talk of giving someone the finger. It's crazy that the cops found out who it belonged to, though. That kind of detective work deserves a thumbs up. What the fuck is up, Internet? Welcome to the channel, and welcome to this episode of Crazy Ass News. Crazy Ass News is a series where I scour the internet for crazy, recent, under the radar news stories that I don't know anything about. I pick articles based solely on their headlines and then I read through them while talking shit the whole time. During the afternoon of July 5th, this is in the afternoon, Tacoma Police Department TP, TPD officers responded to a report of a finger found in a driveway in the 800 block of South Pine Street. Man, South Pine Street sounds like a pretty nice place to live until you find out there's just fingers laying in people's driveways in the afternoon. According to a statement, TPD Public Information Officer Detective William Muse sent to My Northwest. My Northwest? Wait, what? Is that a news thing? I don't know what My Northwest is. Muse provided an update in a statement to My... Okay, My Northwest must be a news organization. I never heard of it. Thursday that a person saw the story and called the Pierce County Medical Examiner's Office, which had taken custody of the digit to claim the finger. Oh my God. How do you lose your finger? I hope we get some more detail, because I want to know how this person <laughs> lost her finger and then was just sitting around watching the news, hoping it would come up. And then it did. And so they called the medical examiner's office to get their finger back. What? The man identified himself by his surname and admitted to losing multiple digits, messing around with some fireworks. Whoa. This guy blew up his hand with fireworks and they flew into the neighbor's driveway? Is that what happened? Muse didn't provide the identity of the man who claimed the finger in his statement. He did explain that the latent prints on the recovered finger correspond with the information about the person available in the FBI database. So these numbers weren't... I mean, when they found them, they must have... How'd they know they were fingers? <laughs> they were blown up. They could have looked like fucking sausages. Were they, like, burnt? What the fuck? How are the finger... And yet there were still fingerprints on them. What a crazy ass story. Muse concluded his statement by saying the case has been assigned to an investigator and added that no criminal charges will be pursued. Dude, how do you blow your f fireworks, man? I don't understand why people are so crazy about blowing off their... or setting off their own fireworks. Like, I don't understand what the... What the whole... I mean, yeah, I mean, who doesn't like loud noises and fucking flames and and explosions and shit? But I mean, dude, people get their... Like, this guy's fingers ended up in his neighbor's driveway. At least one of them. Who knows where the other ones went? Tacoma police said there was no blood around the finger and it appeared to have been possibly left on the property by an animal. Perhaps a bird? Okay, so it didn't fling all the way over the neighbor's yard. An animal carried it there. Jesus Christ. At the time, TPD officers attempted to identify the finger using a portable fingerprint scanner, but no identification was able to be made. Yeah, it was probably still burnt the fuck up. That is crazy. Calls were made to local hospitals, but they didn't report anyone being treated over the 4th of July holiday for any sort of dismembering injury. So this dude didn't even go to the hospital? Is that the whole story? I guess so. So, <laughs> he didn't even go to the hospital? So he got his fingers blown off and then watched the news until somebody reported his finding his fingers. 
And I mean, I don't. Who knows where? We didn't even get this guy's name at all. But where he lived, you know what I mean? Uh, compared to where this, where it was found, was it like blocks? Was it in the same town? Was it like the neighborhood over? A couple houses down? Like they think it could have been a bird? <laughs> a bird picked up this man's finger out of the grass and carried it. And just said, fuck, I can't even carry this bitch anymore. I thought it was a sausage. Fuck. I was like, ew, was that bone? And dropped it in the neighbor's fucking driveway. Crazy. Dude, I mean... Look, if you're gonna... If you want to set off fireworks, whatever. I mean, to each their own. Follow the instructions, man. If it says, like... <laughs> there's gotta be a way to do these safely without losing your goddamn <laughs> hands your fingers what the fuck having a bird fucking cart your finger away is a crazy is crazy work it's crazy work anyway <laughs> that's all i have for now i'll catch you on the next one later